Welcome back, this is Baller Scooper with more Let's Play Diablo 3 Reaper of Souls. When we last left off, I beat the game. Today we're going to go into adventure mode. I did have to actually set that up in the game settings in order to get that started. We're still going to stay on master because I assume that things are going to get quite difficult for me here. I have not done anything with adventure mode. The character is exactly the same as when we last left him off. So let's see what adventure mode has for us. I honestly have no idea what I'm getting into here. I could die very, very quickly. Then again, I haven't been dying all that much as we've been going on. How often am I using Paragon points that I need to use them 10 at a time? Good lord, game. That is insane. So, it has been a while since I have played any Diablo 3. There were no updates since I last played, thankfully, but looks like there's a few people that want to talk to me. Hey, do Auric? Greetings, Nephilim. I can create a rift so you might test your skill in battle, but first, I require a keystone. What? So, he needs a keystone. Okay, tell me about these rifts. Ancient Nephilim tested their worth by fighting through enchanted realms. It was I who opened these rifts for them. Oh, he's been around forever, that apparently. That was my calling, and I always answered it. Then, for many years, there were no Nephilim who had need of me. I am glad to be of use again, champion. Good. I I'm happy that you're happy. So, how do I get a keystone? Only the most powerful of Nephilim can enter the rifts, and they are the ones who can summon me from my rest. I passed many years in silence and darkness before you arrived, and yet you are different from your ancestors, are you not? I'm better. I shall take great interest in your actions. Good, because I shall do very well with them. Alright, so I have no idea how to get this underway. A rift keystone. Oh, I still have all this stuff that I never identified or anything like that. We could probably take care of that real quick. I doubt that there's a lot of things that, that are, are going to be better than what I had. Everything's kind of in the same spot still? Yeah, looks like everything's in the same spot. Alright, let's go through it quickly. It's been a while since I've done this, but hey, let's look at what I could have gotten. Uh, or I did get, actually, from the... From the last boss from Malthael. Uh, this. I I'm going to stick with what I got because I am using Bash. It actually lowers my toughness somehow as well. Hey, learn uh, Reaper's Wraps as well. All right, chances are nothing's going to be good here. That's for the jeweler. Ooh. All right, so this is how I usually go through it. I would just kind of wing it, go through it real quick. That's actually better. That is better. It's less damage, but better overall. That is better overall, but I'm not going to do it because I need money. Money is vital. I forgot that I had actually had all this stuff still just hanging around. What was that? No, 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 and no. All right, boom, boom. And get rid of this one as well. And that's it. That's all you that's all I really do. Not that interesting if you ask me, but I know some people do want to look at it. Alright. Uh you can learn this. Do I have anything for you? I don't. Too bad. Head back to the stash, drop off everything that isn't potions, and we're good to go. Let's talk to Tyriel. He apparently will point me in the way of a keystone. Greetings, Nephilim. Though you have defeated many powerful foes, there remains much to be done. He's talking down here. This is a map of Sanctuary and the realms beyond. From here, you can select a region to view it in greater detail. This map displays the different places you can go within the region. Locations marked by an exclamation point have bounties for you to undertake. Bounties are the many tasks and challenges which require your attention. Are these going to be like dailies? In return for completing them, 
you will be rewarded with powerful items. Hopefully. Good luck, Nephilim. Sanctuary has need of you. All right, what? This world is always in peril, my friend. Even places we once believed to be safe. What? Okay, so talk Thank to him. Thank you for coming here. There are many bounties to undertake nearby. Is this the same thing? Nope, he, he's got more things to say, though. A new cause. You have achieved much in your travels, Nephilim. But the forces of chaos never rest. As you fight these forces, you will gather blood shards. They hold a strange power, though we do not yet know what they are. Sounds interesting. Perhaps you can help us find out. Oh, of course, I'll do it. It's not like you guys are anyway. Tell me about Kadala. I didn't realize there was going to be so much talking this time. Kadala heard about us during her travels. She is here to help, in her own way. Or rob us all blind. Kadala wants to turn a prophet, just like her father Geed always did. Hey, I remember Kane Geed. told me a great deal about him, and most of it wasn't good. No, not so good. But it is your decision whether or not to buy from her. I'll consider well, I it. wouldn't, unless you're in the market for some overpriced garbage. I usually am. Usually am. Keep in watch. Scouts come to me regularly with reports on enemy activity in the surrounding lands. Based on this information, I can send you to the places where your aid is most needed. Using the map. Fantastic. So, is it her? Today. No, that's Miriam? Won't be disappointed. I remember Squirt the Peddler. Who's Kadala then? I don't remember a Kadala. No yeah, everybody around here is just the same old people. I don't remember Kadala. Oh, you're Kadala. How you doing? Mystery weapons using blood shards. All right, that that doesn't sound good. Uh, you may even I may even get a legendary or a set item. Well, that's that's wonderful. I was never one for gambling in these games. You chose the perfect time to reform the Haradrim, Tyrion. Our troubles never cease, do did they? He, did he do it, it again? It seem not. Although we lost many to Malthale, there are more who fight to help us at any cost. Oh, he just didn't get all There's of them. There's no easy burden to carry the name Haradrim, but some are willing to bear it. So, that's apparently it. Let's uh, head into the map. Let's start with Act 1, I would assume. Uh, looks like they want me to take out the butcher again. That's what it looks like here. We'll go to the exclamation points. We'll take on a few of these. We'll see what I can find along the way. Uh, kill the butcher. Yeah, they just want me to kill the butcher, so at least we get boss fights. Holy crap, things are already working out well for me. Jeez. So much in the way of enemies already to start. Alright, screw it. Let's make everybody bounce. Like I said, it has been a while for me, so you have to excuse me if I don't do everything perfectly to start here, but I'll get the hang of it pretty quickly, I assume. Hopefully I get the hang of it pretty quickly. The Enchantress is holding up! Did not anticipate that, to be honest with you. Gotta stay out of the Frozen now that I'm no longer Super Saiyan. No. No. Ah, oh, I tried to get out. They wouldn't let me, though. They would not let me. So many monsters that are all illusionist. I didn't even see that there were things that I needed to avoid that. Oh, he's almost gone. He's almost gone. Down he goes. Alright, hold on. Just that, that wasn't far enough. Alright, should be easy enough here. There we go. And I get a vital seal for it. Alright, we need to find the butcher. I don't know if I fully remember where it was. That was, uh... Wormwood Mangler of Heroes, apparently. Oh, good god! Look at all these monsters! This is starting to get ridiculous! This! This is going to be a lot harder than I thought. I thought it was just going to be kind of a quick 
go in and, and kill the guy and go out. That is not what is going on here at all. This is this is actually pretty pretty substantial. Just goes to show. They really want people to spend a lot of time on this game. Not entirely sure how much time I want to dedicate to this game, but they want it to be long term. I think I, I, well, actually, I did see a video from uh, the recent BlizzCon. I didn't get a chance to go, unfortunately. I was oh, I was actually busy that weekend as well, so I didn't get. I, I wouldn't have probably gotten a chance to go unless I, I really went out of my way to make room. Uh, but I, I did see a video that said that they wanted uh, what they refer to as a long tail for this game. In other words, they wanted you to play for you know two years uh, before you found the things that you actually wanted, uh, which is very similar to what they did in Diablo 2. I uh, remember with the Stones of Jordan and all that kind of stuff. I know people that played that, I don't want to say every day, uh, between Diablo 2 being released and Diablo 3 being released, but that's what they made it sound like. And they were like, yeah, I found three Stones of Jordan. I'm like, oh, that's fantastic. What does that do? Ah, so much damage. And they can tank it all. Just for the record, I haven't made it out of the first room here. I don't know if this is the right way, but I'm gonna... I'm, I'm not trying to fully explore this place at all. I am trying to get through to the Butcher. That is my goal. We are, we are not here trying to kill everything and explore every nook and cranny. That is not our goal today. I just wanted to come in, kill the Butcher, and move on. That is looking very unlikely now. I'm surprised that the Enchantress is holding up as well as she is. I didn't even check her equipment. I don't think I had anything that could have give I, I could have given to her anyway. Those guys do build up a big attack, and it's pretty devastating when it lands, but I just don't care enough to dodge it. Especially when I'm surrounded by you know, 13 other things. Makes it a little difficult. And the slow crawl begins. And this is still in Act 2. I assume everything here is max level, though. assume everything is level 61 or higher. Despite the fact that we are in Act... No, we're in Act 1, aren't we? Yeah, the end of Act 1, kill the butcher. I should have gone to a couple other areas. Wait, they're pointing me the other way? They're pointing me right here. How do I go right? So yeah, there's no way for me to go right. So, okay. This way. How the hell do I get right? You guys are making things way too confusing for me. And we just started. I just wanted to know what the hell we're doing. I want some blood shards, I want to kill the butcher, I want the bounties, I want the rewards, I want to get a more and more powerful character. That's ultimately what the goal is here. I, I don't know which way to go. There's not an option for me to go that way, the way that they say. Here we go. Let's see how many I can aggro on my path to the butcher. And I'll just take them all on when I get there. Unless I'm stopped. There we go. Moving on. We're going for drive-bys here. We're not going for war. We're just we're just running on through. Oh great, specials! Uh, Enchantress is dead. That was uh, to be expected. Come on, let me through. Oh, that's where the whirlwind comes in handy. Hey, look, we made it. We made it to the butcher somehow. To the chamber of suffering. Wait, are, you're going to show me the cutscene again? Okay, good. They don't show me the cutscene. And the Enchantress is back. 
I have no idea if this guy's going to be upgraded or not. No way. Doesn't seem upgraded to me. He does have a lot more HP, but uh, I wouldn't necessarily say that he is upgraded from where he used to be. It's going to take me a while. But he is not doing damage to me. Ow! Or he can throw me away. Damn it! I'm not going over there. No, I oh shit! I don't want to stand in the fire. I can shit. He's got the freaking scorpion. Get over here! Shouldn't you be like moving? There you go. See how how good it feels to move from time to time. Stretch those legs of yours. Get out of the fire. Great, now he's in fire again. Can I hit him? Yeah! Oh, no, I'm in the fire. No, no, I'm not. You guys are going to make it difficult for me to kill him if he's constantly just hanging out in the fire. It's still in the fire. Don't care. I don't care about your pittance of damage that you're doing to me. No, oh, damn it! That was across the fire. I can't even tell if he's a he's not in fire over there. I just can't get to him without getting through the fire. No, screw I'm over here now. I'm safe. Safe and sound. Enchantress is stupid, but I am safe. Human flesh better. How come I see two health bars? Oh, do I no I see yeah, his twice. Why do I see his twice? I don't need to see his twice. Down to half health, though. It's time for another Super Saiyan. There we go. Get back over here. Get back over here. Build up. I bash again. And go for this. No! Super Saiyan's going away! Damn it. I, this better be worth it. I went out of my way. I avoided so many, so many enemies. All right, screw it. I'm staying in fire from now on. Whatever. I'll just hang out in the fire all the damn time. What do I care about fire? I heal faster than the fire damages me. So what do I care? Nothing can damage me. I am indestructible. I have shoulders that do that for me. God, fire is everywhere. Got another bad. Meat. Good. That's my philosophy as well. Vegetables are bad. Meat is good. No, get back over here. He's so close. He's so close. We're a win. I have to stop every once in a while to keep bash up. But we're getting there. No. Oh, I was so close. We're a win. No. Down he goes. All right. I got a bounty of uh, not that much, but a lot of experience. Uh, almost up to the next level. Not entirely sure any of that was worth it. What did we get? No, 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 wait. No, not for shoulders. That will do. It does lower my damage, though. I don't know if I want to do that, though. Attack speed's up, but yeah, overall damage is down. It's just as cool. Now I'm gonna keep my my jumping, dead mouse thing. So that didn't work out as well as I would have liked, but uh, I guess we're done here. Hooray! That's done. Uh, we'll we'll continue going through the bounties here, I guess. Oh, she sells the plan for the Hellfire Ring. I guess that's something I need to buy. That's why she's there. Uh, kill enemies in the Weeping Hollow. That shouldn't be an issue. 
Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to just sprint on through. God, that is so powerful. But wait, the Weeping Hollow? This is like the freaking second dungeon of the game? This is... This is real early on, I know that. The so early on that they won't even stand and fight me. <laughs> I have to chase them down. I forgot that about the early part of the game. Alright, we're up to 12. I don't remember where Horus is around here. You know how long it's been since I've been here? It's been months. Not sure I, I recognize... Well, it would be random anyway. Oh no, grotesques! I have this though! Oh, that's still not good enough. Still not good enough. You wilt against my blow. Hey, we have more information about the Crusaders though. Akan gathered the most devout, driven, and martial Zakarum adherents. He taught them to channel the power of life in the same way that the newly founded paladins were being trained. But these recruits, these crusaders, were given insight into the primal powers of Zakarum in a way no paladin ever was. See, once again, make everything bounce for me. Yeah, the crusaders are more powerful than the paladins? Oh, you know I have to be Crusader at some point here. I still plan on doing the, the hardcore run at some point. I'm not entirely sure when I'm going to do that. Honestly, I just saw that they're starting to think about implementing Season 2, which scares the crap out of me. You know how I feel about ladder resets if you've watched me play Diablo 2. Oh, good God, why do you have to reset the ladders?